Editor collection just got better. Hey guys, today I want to talk about a brand new editor collection update that's really unique and really exciting. I'm going to talk about the new Anim Engine, a brand new tool that's added to the collection, some updates, as well as the future of editor collection. So you don't want to miss this one. And let's talk about that last one, the future of editor collection, specifically the updates. And free updates are not going away. If you bought the pack, you get updates to the pack. In the past, I've gone through and updated most, if not all, of the tools, and the release set is a huge update, which is awesome. But the issue with that is sometimes I sit on these new tools for months without you getting to use them. And that means I don't get feedback on them, and again, you don't get to use them. So I'm going to try out something different, and I want to hear your feedback in the comments down below. We're going to do some smaller, more frequent updates, so that way you get access to the tools, and I can hear feedback right away. So starting today is going to be the first update that includes Anim Engine version 4, and this is going to be showing up into three tools. One new one, and then two amazing updates. The first new tool is a tool called Whip List, and it lets you put up to 15 items on the screen, it automatically lays them out, it animates them, and it renders really fast. The cool thing about this is it isn't 15 different text boxes that you type into. It's one. All you need to do is press enter, it's going to add in another item to the list, it's going to add its bullet point, it's going to do the styling. It is incredibly easy. I have a full video tutorial out that you can watch and learn all about this new tool because I can't just do it justice in this video. Second on the list, WibZoom got updated with Anim Engine version 4. Especially the effect version of this tool really benefits from that, so again check out the full video on that to hear all about the new stuff. The biggest update to an existing tool though is WibCam. This is crazy. Instead of going from full screen down to the corner and then back up to the full screen, you can now take it down to the corner, move it to a different corner, change its size, do all of that stuff right from the tool, still no keyframes. I've been having so much fun with this while editing my videos because it just makes it way more fun, makes it so much easier to add some quality and polish to your videos with the camera moving over instead of just snapping there. The other huge thing about this update is WebCam now has real-time motion blur just like WebZoom. So if you want to learn all about the new updates in WebCam and learn how to use this, really take advantage of it, you guessed it, I have a video explaining all of that available now. So while it's only three tools that got updated, these are some big changes and hopefully gives you an idea of what's to come in the future. So let me know down in the comments what your favorite part of this new update is, if you guys have any comments on this new style of releases, and what tool you want to see updated in the next version of Editor Collection. Thank you guys so much for your support, I hope I can keep adding value to this pack just like this free update, and if you guys have any questions, just let me know.